Good evening. How you baby daddy? You sister and your cousin. How you doing? And you have too. How y'all living, fam? It's Thursday up in this motherfucker. And we are in another part of the gym that you guys know how to custom to. We are at the basketball court. You see Juice, Ed, Manish doing their thizz night. But Juice is over there somewhere. You see him? Over there, over there, over there. Manish trying to do. I don't know what the fuck she's trying to do. Juice over there, over there. Ed over here. What up, Ed? What up, y'all? Hey, man. I know, man. It's been a few damn days. Longer than that. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Like it's yeah, it's been. Oh, yeah. Because every time we come up in here, we either just miss him or. He comes in after us, or either one, whatever. And then I've been down now for two weeks. Manishka and I have been broken. For real. For like three weeks straight. Manishka's had a horrible back. I've had the back, shoulder, neck issue. Then I had the leg issue before that. Y'all know the deal. Why are we broke? I don't know. I don't know what the deal is. What happened? Y'all injury prone, man. That's uh -oh, not prone. Y'all injury prone. That's All not good. Prone. That's not All good, though, dog. Injury prone. That's I'm injury horrible. Prone. My injury's gonna be that bad. Prone. Are you gonna do the sprint? No. She can't run. She can't sprint. Oh, you, you know, can't do that. Sprint. Yeah, she went to the chiropractor and she's not alive. I'm gonna see how I can hold up. Ed said you have to run down there and back to here in eight seconds. Yeah, right, not me. But I'm here because oh, no. we're gonna do this cardio. Oh, no. <laughs> we're gonna do this cardio. Okay, so what are we doing? So you do, uh, if you make a free throw, we do one, one sprint, which is one back and down. Yeah. And then if you don't make the free show, then we do two. Yeah. Not stop. Oh, geez. You don't go down and back and stop. You go down, back, down, back. Twice, yeah. Yeah, as fast as possible. So how many times do we, we have to give ourselves a limit? How, how many times are we doing this? I mean, we can do this for 10 minutes. Huh? We can do this for 10 minutes. This motherfucker act like oh I play basketball on a regular. All right, let's roll, let's roll. We can do it for 10 minutes. We got it, okay, we got this. Oh, look at Juice, look at Juice. LeBron! <laughs> Kobe! <laughs> Damn! It hurt. It's like people. It's like people all over the court. MJ! Damn, yeah, none of them niggas work. Out. Okay! Alright, let's go. To where? Over there? Are there kids over there? No, not over on that side, but on the opposite side of the court. Right it's cool, it's cool, it's cool. We got it. You know what I'm saying? We're finna get you're, you're in. Standing, you're standing right here, right? You about to leave? There's a wall over there. This water, I think this young water. You want to put your stuff in my bag? So we can take my, we can move my bag down. Stop. Hey man, you know what I'm saying? You know you're still on camera, right? Yep. Let's go. Okay. Wait, is there a ledge over there? No, there's no ledge over there. There's a ledge all the way Oh, we can there. leave it here. If we're just going to go right here. There's a ledge all on the, like, on the other court. We're just going to be right here, right? I'm scared, but that's how we're gonna get it in. Let's go. Don't get me in the back. It's awkward. What? How is it awkward? Don't how is it awkward? Back. What? How is it awkward? How is it awkward? Don't get me in the back. Just so you guys are aware, remind me never to do sprints at the beginning of the workout. 
I felt like I was gonna throw up. <laughs> and no, it's not for anything else, but for the fact that, you know, when you do sprints like that, like, especially if any of you guys have played basketball and did like suicides or any of those types of things you guys already know, or any kind of jump training, it's pretty typical <laughs> when you haven't done that type of sprinting. Because y'all just saw us doing our last series of sprints when we were exhausted, but I mean, I was pushing them those first few. And man, when you haven't done a workout like that in a while, you almost feel nauseous like you want to throw up. I'm about to go sit with my people's name and order some food. I pooped. And I'm finna order food. You. Good morning. How your baby daddy, your sister, your cousin, what I'm doing? And you happy too? How y'all living, fam? It's Friday. Early morning in this motherfucker. When I say early morning, I have been at the gym, as you guys can see, on another side of the gym, since 5.15 or so in the a.m. I just got done with cycling. It's the first time I've taken a cycling class here. I used to take cycling years ago. I used to do it so much more often. It's such a great workout. It's great, especially for people who have ailments like back issues and stuff like that, or you're just trying to kind of, you know, chill out and not overexert yourself upper body wise. And, uh, yeah, anyway, your girl got up this morning at about, uh, let's see if this is open. Your girl got up at about 4.30 this morning and uh, went ahead, got up, took my fat burners and uh, went ahead and had, you know, I boiled some eggs so when I get back I can have that, but had a little, uh, like a protein bar slash type of snack bar just to kind of have something in my system and uh, rushed out to the door to head out to this class at 5.30. And it was awesome, not gonna lie though, if you haven't done cycling in a while, ease your way into that motherfucker because it's been a few years since I've done it. And the girl that was teaching the class today was hella hard, however, it was a great workout. And, because typically I don't work out on Fridays, I was like, you know what, let me go ahead, get a workout in, and uh, get it done so I don't have an excuse to not come. I'm actually, I wish I could show you, I'll show you, maybe I'll show you upstairs. I don't know if there's a, there's no mirror in here anywhere that I could show y'all, but I'm wearing my, um, either I'm off and on wearing my waist trainer or I wear this little wrap that I got from Wally World. The wrap is like literally $4. Well, at least when I got it, it was four. It's typically pretty damn cheap. They have leg wraps, they have arm wraps, and I'm doing the stomach wrap right now with saran wrap and um, uh, albaline underneath. So I'm just gonna be doing that periodically over the next, you know, little while. <sighs> but man, it's hard getting back when you have not, um, you know, when you took off so much time, so it's good. I came yesterday, worked out. Those sprints were killer, by the way, so I'm gonna try to do those. I would never recommend doing those types of sprints, number one, if you haven't done them in a while, because I haven't. And number two, because, um, you know, we did the whole length of the basketball court, or, you know, the width of the basketball court, but I wouldn't suggest doing them at the beginning of your workout, because yesterday I did them at the beginning and I suffered. Like, that was not a good idea, because by the time you get done, because we were doing it in four minute intervals, so we would go, one was considered one and back, but we would do, go back and forth. So he would go, and then I would go, and he would go, and I would go. And we did that four minutes straight, which is a lot. And then we did another set of four minutes straight sprints back and forth the same way. Juice did it with us the first time, and then the second time it was just Ed and I. Man, look. Um, yeah, we're not gonna do that again. <laughs> at the beginning, I would do that at the end. Even if you're gonna feel a little tired, it's better to do it at the end so you can save some of that energy for the lifting and whatever other things you wanna do. But anyway, Juice is still asleep. Well, actually, no. It is 6.30 right now, so he should be up by now. Getting ready for work, so I'm gonna go ahead and uh, since the basketball court is empty, I'm gonna do a couple like quick sprints because since I did them yesterday, now I'm like determined to really do better with them. We're training with Jessica tomorrow bright and early in the morning. Oh, I forgot to tell you. Hold on, let me make sure there's enough room on this camera so I can check out. Yeah, there it is. Okay, totally forgot to tell y'all because I uh, didn't really vlog after we worked out yesterday, obviously. Um, Anyway, um, guess who signed up for a dance class? The kid. So, um, you guys know I've been wanting to take, one, I've been wanting to take a pole dancing class for the longest time. Um, and not for anything, you know, cray cray. It's just a great ab workout. It works different muscles in your body that you wouldn't normally work out. And it's just fun, you know? And, um, but anyway, I've been wanting to do that, but I've also wanted to take a hip hop class. <laughs> And there's a guy that teaches hip hop in uh, St. Louis that I've been wanting to get taught by. And he actually teaches a few classes out here. 
And I was like, you know what, I'm gonna look up the classes, I'm gonna see if he's teaching, and I'm just gonna enroll. If I find him, I'm gonna enroll. And I did, so anyway, the classes are actually going on, um, they're week, they're, it's just once a week, and I have, I have my first class tomorrow. So, work out with Jessica in the morning, and then later on I have my dance class, so wish me luck. I'm not the most, here's the thing, I can dance my ass off, although you haven't probably really ever seen it, but my coordination is horrible when it comes to like choreographed dance, which is why I wish that I had done more dance when I was younger. I wish my mom and dad had kind of pushed me to stick to doing dance and not let me just kind of figure it out, even though, I did enjoy, you know, you know, getting into other things like sports and other stuff like that. But still, I wish I had been pushed to stay in dance more because I love it that much and I wish I had gotten that skill set. So anyway, that being said, I went ahead and enrolled. My first class is tomorrow and I'm excited. I'm nervous, but I'm excited. So we'll see. Anyway, um, hopefully I'll be able to vlog a little bit in there. I may wait and kind of maybe vlog when I first get there and stuff and just kind of see what the temperament is because I don't know how they feel about cameras being in there and it's been a few years since I've actually done a dance class so anyway all right I'm gonna do these sprints and then let me see what time it is as I need to eat breakfast so I need to go ahead and do I'm just gonna do a couple of sprints just to kind of get the juices flowing I'm gonna do a little bit of ab work and then I'm gonna get out of here so I see y'all back at the crisp all right I am done and just because the uh, the uh, you know this place is open I figured I might as well get a um, little protein shake while I'm here um, which by the way I've been meaning to tell you guys this and I'll probably show you guys in my monthly phase and I'll help to the nose because I've been trying so many different things not just makeup I mean food wise whatever the case may be I'm not the biggest fan of the uh, the protein shakes from uh, uh, what you call it damn it to hell you know what brand I'm talking about, the ones where we get the protein chips from. I'm not the biggest fan of it. It's the consistency of the product. Thank you so much. Yeah, um, not the biggest fan of the consistency of the product at all. And I have to show you guys what it is. Remember, oh, I think we kind of mentioned it. Juice actually can tolerate it, but he can handle a lot more than I can. I'm a consistency person, so if something has a weird consistency or texture, whether it's good or not, I'm not gonna go I'm not gonna go in on it because it's just like I don't know. I don't like weird textures and it's a weird textured protein shake um, it's more of a protein shake you probably need to put inside of something and then blend it in the blender versus it being a shaker protein shake um, I don't know what quest nutrition I just totally blanked out but yeah quest nutrition not the biggest fan of the protein shake um, the chocolate one hasn't been the taste is fine I just don't like the consistency so one of these days when juice makes one I will show you um, the consistency of it it tastes good I just don't like the consistency so anyway I meant to tell you guys that, and um, so yeah, but the protein chips and all that so far, and I still have not tried that weird looking pasta stuff, and I really want to, um, I've been meaning to make pasta all week, ironically enough, or the zucchini noodles, so maybe I'll make it over the weekend, or just Monday or something, I'll just plan for it, but anyway, let me get out of here, because um, I want to see my baby before he goes to work. Good morning, how your baby daddy, your sister, and your cousin, I'm doing and you're happy too. How y'all living, fam? It's Saturday morning up in this motherfucker. And yeah, I know you guys are gonna be like, where the hell and what the hell have y'all been vlogging? Because I know you saw Thursday's early, like, I guess Thursday's little workout session, or a couple minutes of it. I know you saw Friday morning, rock, butt crack it down early morning workout session. I really didn't see much else after that until now. See, what had happened was I forgot my damn camera at the cribbo and uh, hung out with Juice. Well, Juice went to work, blah, 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 and then we left. And uh, or I, we met up, went and grabbed, you know, some dinner and blah, blah, blah. But then I, I had left my camera at the cribbo. One. And two. I don't know. You know how things go. You get to talking, hanging out, shooting the shit. We started talking to the wait, wait staff. We're, you know, drinking, having a good time. Didn't pull my, even my iPhone out. So, here we are. <laughs> you know, the next day. Nothing really too crazy happened yesterday. Nothing crazy happened the day before. Which is why there really wasn't much to vlog. And you know, some days it bees like that sometimes. So, here we are, Saturday morning. Getting ready to work out with Jessica, getting a warm up, and juice is slow as hell as usual. And uh, he trying to rev it up because you hear the, the noise all of a sudden. He's trying to rev it up and shit now. Yeah, rev it up. Uh huh. 
Yeah. Huh? Yeah. Anyway, so yeah, Jess is in the bathroom. I'm having my Zion. And uh, just getting a little warm up in. And uh, yeah, the past three days we've been getting it in. It feels, you know, better arm wise. My arm feels better. But, uh, you know, I'm trying to be careful. A little nervous. I don't want to re injure. But uh, we're not going to be doing any back things today. So, um, and she knows, of course. So, hopefully, we'll do some cardio and uh, nothing too cray cray because I don't know. I feel like I'm still not 100% one. And two, taking that time off because of that damn neck arm thing set us the back. So, you know, I'm back on the fat burners, which I told you guys a couple days ago. So, I've been doing that. But now it's a matter of being in this gym consistently, which we have been, and sticking to it, which we have been so far. So that's it, you know? No idea what our plans are for the day. Um, oh, I have one thing I can definitely say that I'm doing. Hip hop class tonight. So I am doing that today. Um, so yeah. And I think we might meet up with Bambi and Jonathan tonight. Maybe. Um, it's supposed to be really nice out. It's nice out right now. Sun's out. It's in the 60s right now. And, uh, yeah. Yeah, so. Let's see how the day goes. Let's see how to Jess. Hi, Jess! What is that? What the hell? I don't want those. What the hell's that? TRX? Oh, God. I like it better on you than with us. How about that? Yeah, pretty much. Oh, Lord. Alright. Let's go.